All right. Today we're going to talk about the theorem of a parallelogram is a rectangle, then its diagonals are congruent. This happens to be part of the common core requirements of the uh, congruency fact is on number 11 and in, under that one they state rectangles are parallelograms with congruent triangles or, excuse me with congruent diagonals so yes so therefore this is what we have given we have a parallelogram ABC D is a rectangle and I have sketch one here and then what we're trying to prove is that the diagonals which is a C is congruent to BD. Now the first statement I am going to write down here is number one is that this is a rectangle I got that this is my symbol for a rectangle A B C D and of course that's one that is given. Next number two I know that because I have a parallelogram that this side A uh, A B is congruent to DC and likewise BC to AD because the opposite sides of parallelograms are congruent. So I will put down here AB is congruent to DC and likewise BC is congruent to AD. And of course these are all segments, all right, for clarity there. And then for two, I'm going to put down opposite opposite sides of parallelogram there's my parallelogram are congruent okay number three I know that this is a rectangle because that was what was in the, in the uh, in the given I know therefore that this angle right here of uh, let's see I'm going to use this angle of a this angle, all right, and this angle, okay, and therefore what I have here, I can make, I know these two angles right here because I'm going to draw a triangle here and a triangle here, so I know that, that these two angles are congruent to each other because they both equal 90 degrees, which means that because this is a rectangle. So I'm going to put down here angle A is congruent to angle D and as, uh, as so forth and, and they because we know they both all equal to 90 degrees and so I can say uh, on this right here is 3 I know that the uh, uh, angles of a rectangle are equal to 90 degrees and therefore they are they are congruent oh, congruent okay now I also from that now you saw me trace this triangle right here and then it goes across here and this goes down from down here all right so with this strategy right here I know that if I can do make these triangles congruent then I know that my these these right here will be corresponding parts and therefore they will be congruent and then I will have solved my problem so put down here for step number four is a triangle let's start here B A D triangle B A D is congruent to triangle C D A congruent to triangle C D A all right and then uh, for uh, four the reason for that is going to be side angle side and then step number five, I've already proven that, so that's got AC, segment AC is equal to, actually they're congruent, to, uh, try, uh, to uh, where am I doing here, the BD, all right, to BD, segment BD. And that is because of five of corresponding parts of uh, congruent triangles. So we have then completed this, ta uh, this uh, proof of the theorem that a parallelogram that is a rectangle, if a parallelogram that is a rectangle, then its diagonals are congruent. Thank you.